It finally happened. We've been waiting for what seems like forever for what was sure to be an amazing wedding day. And we'll just say Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker did not disappoint. And even if we weren't able to attend Courtney and Travis's wedding, there are plenty of other events happening that we'd love to go to. And if you like live events, check out SeatGeek.com and use the promo code TTC for $20 off your first order. Number 1. A star-studded event When you're a member of one of the most famous families in America, you're bound to know a lot of people, many of whom are some of the biggest names in Hollywood. So it doesn't come as much of a surprise that people like Machine Gun Kelly, Megan Fox, and Devin Booker were a few of the names on the list at that wedding. And then of course there's the entire Car jenner clan, whose combined net worth could probably pay for the wedding many times over. Number 2. A Portofino Wedding Venue We've already seen Courtney and Travis cruise their way through Italy on vacations and high-profile events, and they made their way back to Italy, Portofino to be exact, to celebrate their special day. But of course, they didn't get married at just any venue. Instead, they opted for the Villa Olivietta, which is essentially a gorgeous castle and was even decorated by Domenico Dolce and Stefano Gabbana themselves. Number 3. An Ode to Travis it probably comes as no surprise, but Courtney's wedding dress was an event in and of itself. Specifically, we're talking about the veil. Not only was the wedding head at Dolce & Gabbana's home, but Courtney and Travis worked with the designers on their wedding attire. Courtney wore a custom Dolce & Gabbana Alta Moda mini dress with a long veil that depicted the Virgin Mary, which could be an ode to Travis and his faith. He has a Virgin Mary tattoo himself, and after being the only survivor in a fatal plane crash, he's been open about his beliefs in religion. And we love that Courtney took that into consideration on their big day. Number 4. Family in Fashion If the Car Jenners know how to do anything, it's make a fashion statement. And for Courtney and Travis's wedding, those who attended did just that. Compliments of, you guessed it, Dolce & Gabbana, of course. Kim and Chloe opted for fitted black gowns, while Kendall and Kylie wore fitted dresses with floral prints. Chris, on the other hand, arrived wearing a feathered outfit that stood out from the outfits her kids wore. But according to Kylie's TikTok video, at least it looked like Chris wore something she could easily move around in to enjoy the reception. Number 5. Love Doesn't Come Cheap Are we really surprised? The Car Jenners are known for their lavish parties and even more extravagant weddings, and this one was right on brand with that. A source let Life & Style magazine in on all the wedding details, including multiple gourmet meals, beautiful views and scenery, incredible decorations, and great music. The insider estimated, a wedding weekend like that could easily cost more than $2 million. If you include all the fashion, another $2 million. Number 6. Blended Families Both Courtney and Travis have kids from other relationships, and the beautiful thing about their wedding was that all of their children were able to come together to celebrate their new blended family. And Travis's kids, Alabama and Atiana, served as Courtney's bridesmaids for the event. Courtney's daughter, Penelope, served as the flower girl for the ceremony. While the ceremony was kept pretty small and not all of the Car Jenner kids could make it, we love that Travis and Courtney's kids got to be there to celebrate such a huge day for their parents. Number 7. No Shows Like we mentioned, the wedding party was pretty small. Life & Style magazine's insider actually stated that there were only about 35 guests total. But even then, there were other friends and relatives that surprisingly didn't attend. Scott Disick and Kanye West, both who had other obligations, are among a few of them. Even Rob Kardashian opted to stay home and celebrate from afar. Tristan Thompson, Pete Davidson, and Travis Scott also couldn't make it. Even Chloe's lifelong friends, Malika and Kadia, sent their best wishes from back home. Number 8. Wedding Number 3. Technically. While this was probably the biggest celebration of Courtney and Travis's marriage, it definitely wasn't the first. In April of this year, the two got in a little bit of wedding day practice after getting hitched in Las Vegas after the Grammy Awards. They didn't have a marriage license then, but later officially got married a few weeks later in Santa Barbara in front of Courtney's grandmother, MJ, and Travis's father, Randy. Number 9. A Leap of Faith in one sense of the saying, you could probably argue that, even though the two have been madly in love, Courtney and Travis's decision to get married was a leap of faith in their relationship. But we actually mean leap of faith in the literal sense, because the newlyweds literally jumped off of a boat. Well, it was a super yacht, but you get the point. 
With all of the wedding day celebrations and the rush of emotions from that weekend, a lover's leap off of an expensive yacht was probably a good time for them. Number 10. Questionable food. You'd expect everything at a Kardashian wedding to be done big. Big budgets, big decorations, etc. But one thing that surprisingly wasn't that big at all was the portion sizes for the meals served. Don't get us wrong, the wedding seemed like a ton of fun, but we wouldn't be surprised if the guests left a little hungry. But at the same time, most of us would probably still jump at the chance to go if we scored an invite to the wedding. While many of us probably wished we could have joined in on the fun, we're so happy to finally see Courtney and Travis officially tie the knot. It honestly looked like everyone who attended had so much fun, and we wish nothing but the best for the newlyweds. What are your thoughts on the extravagant Italian wedding? Let us know in the comments below, and for more videos just like this one, be sure to like the video and subscribe to The Things Celebrity.